Lego fans, it's Mike the Bricks Nerd, and today I've got one of the Hobbit sets to review. It's number 79003, An Unexpected Gathering. It comes with 652 pieces. You get six minifigures, Gandalf the Grey, Bilbo Baggins, Ball and the Dwarf, Dwal and the Dwarf, Bofur the Dwarf, and Bombur the Dwarf. And this set costs about $70 US. And then a look at the back of the box. This is Bag End, which is Bilbo Baggins' home. Uh, and this is Gandalf the Grey. He invites all the dwarves to have a party here. Uh, and this also does have a removable top, so it's easier for access inside. Okay, so let's unbox it and see what's inside. Okay, so it looks like we get... One, two, three, four packs in there. You got two beige plates. You got one green one. You got some stickers. Uh, you got instruction guide number one and instruction guide number two. Okay, I am excited. Let's build this thing.
And there's our completed set. Now let's take a look at all the details on this. Okay, so let's look at the front of the building here. Uh, you have flowers all throughout. You got a little shrub here. Uh, you got a half barrel with some carrots and an apple in there. You got the front gate that opens and closes. You've got a little garden that's growing right there. Got a little light that's up here. The front door, which opens inward. And then we'll take a look at the side of the building. And we'll swing around to the back and then we'll look at the back. Now we'll take a look on the inside. Over here you've got an extra dagger, a couple bottles, there's a shelving unit here. You got a chest with the shovel in it. You got the three maps down here. There's a barrel and that's got an apple in it. You've got the door which opens on the inside. And then over here, you've got more shelves. There's a bottle and a letter on these shelves here. You've got Bilbo's book, which sits on a stand. And then there's an ink and quill pen to go with it right there. You've got a frying pan, pot, the stove there, a broom. And then we have the seating area with the table. You got six chairs. You have the two plates, and then you have a piece of chicken on each, and green berries, and red berries. You also got two goblets, and then another bottle, a loaf of bread, and a pretzel right there. And then also, there is a removable top. So you can take the top off, and then you have easier access to the inside there. Okay, so now we'll look at the minifigures. This is Gandalf the Grey. He comes with his staff. He's got a cape. And his hat. He's only got the one face. And here is Bilbo Baggins. This is his home uh, bag end. And then he does have the double-sided face. Here is Balin the Dwarf. He comes with a sword. He's got a cape. And then he does have the double-sided face. This is Dwalin the Dwarf. He comes with his hammer club. He's got a dagger. He's only got one face, but he does have markings on the back of his head. He's also got a cape. This is Bofur the Dwarf. He comes with a pickaxe. A cape. And then he does have... A double-sided face. And then last is Bombor the Dwarf. Uh, he has a pot and a sausage, but he also does have a dagger. But in the instructions, that's how they show him being built. And then he does have a double-sided face. Okay, so this is an amazing set. When they said they were coming out with this, I could not wait to go get it. Uh, there's just, there is so much detail on this set. They did a great job on all the minifigures. I mean, if you look up real close to each one, each one has such nice little details all over on them. Um, I like that they gave you six, you know, minifigures in here. So you, that gives you a lot of, characters a lot of people to play with inside the set the removable roof that was a great idea because then it gives you easier access to the inside and there's a lot of stuff on the inside with all the food items 
They give you the maps. There's extra weapons. Pot, pan, broom. You got Bilbo Baggins' book is in there. Um, so there's just there's a lot to do on the inside of it. This set doesn't really have any action motion features like flick muscles or anything like that. You know, pretty much just the door <laughs> that opens. Uh, but that's not what the set's really about. It's it's about you know the the building itself, the Shire, you know, Bag End. Um, so yeah, I just I absolutely love love the detail on this. So just want to thank you guys for watching. I'll see you on the next build.